So in today's news, the native doctors in Nigeria have decided to drag the CAC to court over their refusal to register the association. And also, the federal government has put a ban on the importation of SIM card. And also, the CAC has decided to replace the driver's license and passport with name during their registration. So begin with the first news for today. Native doctors drag CAC to court over refusal to register association please if you've not subscribed please do well to subscribe so you always get updated whenever there's a new post for you the traditional religious practitioners association trpa has filed a lawsuit against the corporate affairs commission in the federal high court in enugu state this comes after the cac refused to register the traditional practitioners as a religious body in nigeria wow so this is so the traditional practitioners they are saying that since the cac has registered the christian organizations and some muslims some muslim organizations they should also register the traditional organizations like the missive doctors so that's what they are saying here okay we'll move on to the next news cac to replace driver's license and passports with name for registration wow the Corporate Affairs Commission, CAC, has stated that it will now start using the National Identification Number, NIN, during business and company registration. Well, this was announced by the Registrar General of the Commission, Garba Bubaka, during the 2022 management retreat held in Kano State. He said, for every Nigerian and a foreigner residing in Nigeria and a foreigner residing all we will require from you moving forward is your NIN and we will validate your information from the NIN. If there are discrepancies, we will not register. You have to rectify it. So this is what they are saying now. So whenever you're going to register your business or your company, you don't have to bring your driver's license and passport again because they will now be needing your NIN. I move on to the next news for today. Federal government bans importation of SIM cards. Wow. The federal government has put a ban on the importation of SIM cards. Well, the announcement was made by the Minister of Communications and Digital Economy, Issa Pantami, on Monday. Issa Pantami, who spoke at the Nigerian Telecommunications Indigenous Content Expo, said the reason for the ban is to increase indigenous content in the ICT sector. Well, this comes a month after the minister announced the establishment of a SIM card manufacturing plant in Lagos State. And this brings us to the end of the news for today. Please, if you've not subscribed, please do also subscribe so you always get updated whenever there's a new post for you. And also, feel free to like this video, share it on your various social media handles. Thank you so much for coming back. We hope to see you again tomorrow.